What's happening guys? So, I just picked up these KYB struts. Got a good deal from a seller on Facebook Marketplace selling a set of KYB struts and springs from an NA Miata and only had 20,000 miles or so, but we got a really good deal only for $80. These are what it looked like. No leakage or anything from the oil or anything. Then also picked up Jackson Racing sway bars, including with the hardware. And I got that for ninety dollars. Now I'm gonna go pick up this roll bar from a guy also in the area. And hopefully this project that we're gonna undertake today can be a nice and productive day. So here are what the original struts that came onto my little Miata over there. I mean, you could still see that it's still okay, but there are some leakage over here in the rear. This is the original sway bar. If you guys want it, in the Chicagoland area over here, I'll be selling it. So DM me or comment down below if you wanna come over and pick it up. Also got brand new set of tires also from Marketplace. These are, look at the treads on these bad boys. Looking brand new. Guess how much I got these for? $100, all four. Just a set of Uni Royal tires for the Miata at 185.60.14s. So, the benefit that I think of riding with stock wheels versus, you know, some 15 inch or whatever wheels out there is that these rims, man, they're so light with the tires and you can get that better acceleration response versus having to get aftermarkets that are pretty heavy and are just meant for looks. These guys are heavy. I will definitely be selling these. Also got these from Facebook Marketplace, like I mentioned. Yeah, they're gonna be relisted in the Facebook's Marketplace for sure. But my God, check out these roll bars that I got from Facebook's Marketplace. As you can tell, it looks really pretty sharp. How it's all set onto it. For the price that we got it for, for $40. I mean, it looks really hella good.
probably be struts install. It makes a big difference versus the stock setup. I wanted to test out originally how it would feel with the stock 14 inch wheels. Going on the turns and hitting bumps stock wheels no problem but with this setup with these wheels that I had when I originally purchased the Miata and then following a couple of months after again Facebook marketplace it's a happy place that's where I found some wheels with brand new tires including with them and size is 225 50 by 15 and they do stick out just a little bit and when I had the original struts on them every little bump that you would hit not small but something severe you would definitely bottom out into but now with this setup it feels still good you really do get a hit a very severe bump in order for the fender to hit onto the wheel the benefit I think if you're building a car, especially if it's a Miata and times today where getting OEM parts is very difficult because of manufacturers not fully at 100% productions. And especially, and if you live in an environment that's heavily populated of individuals either owning Miatas or an environment where you're you can dig up and find individuals on forums and pages that are nearby having used parts linger in their garages you message them you ask them if they have a certain part and try to find a good deal on an offer and for instance also these roll bars over here that are stock OEMs for the NA Miata got that for $40 I think that's the beauty in today's era of social media and apps where users can network with individuals pertaining certain commodities such as gently used aftermarket parts or manufacturer parts for a particular vehicle. definitely find hidden gems out there and have luck in your neighborhood grabbing a set of really well built parts so let's just sum this all up right now I got the, the ruckus from marketplace years back had fun with it Decided to see what else is available around there and found a young kid who had this Miata and asked him if he wanted to trade and two years later here we are now owning it got the whole setup with the exhaust and wheels and struts and the, the roll bar and What's the next project for the Miata? Well, I would definitely like to get a whole new steering wheel that is detachable and, and 
bushings all around to make it feel pretty much smoother and less roll or less play with the suspension and I'm more into the handling than I am with the performance part of either the motor probably rebuild the whole suspension and see what else is available out there especially today in the in the market of Miatas they're actually increasing right now in value well that's pretty much all that I have for this video guys just a quick little rundown on what you can do with the car and especially using social media platforms such as Facebook and utilizing its marketplace to actually buy some parts for either your car or anything of a project that you think could be a benefit either buying tools or accessories or lawnmowers or <laughs> heck even parts for a Miata the possibilities are endless and the sellers are either going to be a hit and miss but that's why you got to do some researching and communication and who knows I mean there are still a lot of things that I'm gonna have to do to this car to make it drivable to my specs of either performance or handling so if you like this video just click that like button and if you're new click that subscribe button that would definitely mean a lot to me and until the next time peace